In this video, we're going to show you the top five easiest and most effective offenses in Madden 24. These schemes are not only easy to run, but are incredibly simple to learn. Where if you watch just this video, you'll be ready to take it right to the virtual gridiron and start winning more games. These offenses also won't be the super basic ones you see, like Gun Bunch or Trips Tight End, which are super common and will often get you bagged online. The first offense I want to show you is my personal favorite, and that is tight doubles in the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook. This offense is top notch because of all the unique routes in the plays, like shot fade cross, P wide receiver cross, and tight curl. Shot fade cross offers us an effortless way to beat cover two and cover three for 40 plus yard gains or even one play touchdowns. Now, to use this play to beat cover three and cover two, all you have to do is align the tight end to the wide side of the field and streak the middle receiver so the player will look exactly like this. So when you see a cover two or cover three defense, simply throw the outside fade for an easy dot. Now P wide receiver cross I covered extensively in my previous video, which I'll link down below. In general, it is very effective at beating double Mabel defenses where the curl flats are set to a five yard depth and the clouds are set to a 30 yard depth. The simple setup for using this play is to drag your tight end, then what you will see is a wide open drag route with the crosser being your second read option. Basically, the wheel route will distract both outside thirds, outside quarters, and curl flat zones, which will leave the entire left side of the field wide open for drags, corner routes, and crossers. The next best play in the tight doubles formation is tight curl which effectively beats every coverage in the game with only one adjustment. Now to set tight curl up, all you need to do is put the middle receiver on a streak and also make sure the tight end is aligned on the short side of the field. Versus cover two, you can simply split the two safeties and throw the streak right between them for an easy one play touchdown. Versus cover four, cover three, and man coverage, the short corner route will be wide open. If neither of these routes are open, you can throw any of the three check down options, including the table route, drag, or backside tight end curl. Now I have my entire Steelers tight doubles game plan on victoryformation.gg if you're looking for some more advanced setups to beat top players online. This next offense, I almost didn't put in the video because it is so overpowered and requires very little Madden skill to run at a super high level. That offense is the spread playbook offense. And yes, I mean the entire playbook as it is loaded with overpowered read options, triple options, shovel options, and RPOs that genuinely break the game. The main overpowered plays in this playbook are the RPO reads and shovel options. Now RPO reads are broken because they cause the corner to blitz instead of defend the screen or bubble receiver. Now if you call the RPO reads in either bunch open offset, double stack, or trio offset, they will all yield the same result. Now to run any of these plays, you simply look at the defensive line. If it is pinched, the RPO receiver will be wide open. If it is spread, you can simply run the ball on it for a 10 plus yard gain. Now the shovel option in gun split slot makes this offense even more overpowered. To run the shovel option, all you're looking to do is identify who the two pass keys are. On this particular play, it's the defensive end and the slot cornerback. If you run this play as is, you will likely only gain or maybe lose a few yards. Now to properly run this play, what you want to do is manipulate the pass keys by motioning inside the inside most slot receiver so the pass key is on the safety instead. The safety will react much slower than the slot corner and this will result in some huge gains for you. Competitive player Sean Madden created a full ebook on this broken offense on victoryformation.gg. Check it out if you want to send your opponents to therapy right after playing them. This next offense is the most explosive of these three. The offensive formation is called gun tight Y off and the best plays in it are switch wide receiver drag, flood drive, TE corner, and PA slot cross. Now the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook is the only one with all four of these plays, but the following playbooks have all of them, 
but switch wide receiver drag. The most explosive play in this offense is switch wide receiver drag, which with up to one hot route, you can bomb every coverage in the game for a one play touchdown. To set this up versus cover three, cover four, and man coverage, all you do is streak the tight end, wait for the receiver on the deep post to pass the quarter or third and throw your wide open touchdown. Versus cover two, you leave the play completely stuck and throw the deep post in between the two safeties. The next best play in tight Y off is flood drive, which I really like versus man coverage defenses. To run this play, I leave it completely stock and just look for the deep post in the middle of the field because it fries man coverage. The play I like versus zone coverage is TE corner. To set this play up, all you need to be aware of is a few things. The TE corner is great versus cover two, and the wide receiver corner is really great versus cover three and cover four. Versus cover three or cover four, I will align the tight end to the short side of the field and simply fade the outside receiver on the two wide receiver side. Now against these coverages, the corner route will be wide open. Versus cover two, I align the tight end on the wide side of the field and streak the wide receiver beside him. Then all you're looking for is the tight end on the deep corner, which will get over the cloud flat and outside of the deep half safety. The last play is probably the best in the game at beating double Mabel defenses, and that is PA slot cross. Now I leave this play completely stock, and what I am primarily looking for is the deep cross on triangle or Y. Now if you use any of these offenses, you'll be well on your way to Madden dominance. If you're looking to see the top three easiest and most effective defenses, check out this video.